Wolf Kist, you are gone over long. We've had trouble. Engelwyn is dead. Though there is a sickness in these Franks, I do not understand. That is very good. It is as I told you. You see now why it is pointless to try to deal with them. Yet I must. Information with him led me to their king. Charles and I have reached the beginnings of an agreement. You met with their king? Do you make yourself my enemy now? Toka failed to bring me any but you, and now you defy me! You said there was trouble. There was another attack, and we found our missing watch. Curse those raven starvers, I will gut every one of them! You might have helped prevent this. Why? What has happened? You will see what it is you are so eager to make peace with. Toka will show you. I have our revenge to plan. Come with me, Wolfkist. You remember our missing watch? While you and Siegfried went after Engelwyn, I searched for them. But they were gone. After this second attack, we found them. What do you mean? Where were they? Come and see. Look. These wounds were not made by the sword, or by animals. It is the Franks. You said yourself, there is a sickness in them. There is no honor in what they do. These were my friends. I have seen this before. People disappear sometimes. When they return, they are like this. Toka, I need your help. Charles asked me to find his queen. If I can, I might stop this sickness reaching England. The queen was at Evreux yesterday, in the company of priests. You will find her there. You think all I do is drink wine and bed handsome men and beautiful women? Merde. I have eyes all over Francia. And they see many things. Some of those things I must attend to now. When you have the time, Evor, come and see me. I have more work for you. Siegfried is right, Wolfkist. Even with this proof of the Franks' cowardice before you, you still want to bargain with them? I will not go against my uncle. I am sorry. I cannot help you in this. You're right. Your duty is to your own clan, Toka. My duty is to mine. It is why I came to Frankia. I will go to Evre alone. When you are done in Evre, meet us at our forward camp, west of Paris. We have a siege to prepare. Charles's army is from England. I must find his queen. She was seen with priests at Evra. That is where I must go.
sit where you can. Little mother will soon begin. The dark waters covered me. Then his holy light came and oh, the glory of his brightness. You will recall the miracle of Saint Orinus, how he raised the burn girl back to life. As a child, I too was burned and near to death. At his altar, the saint appeared, touched me, and I was healed. Time could not corrupt the saint's holy body. He touched me so that now I might touch you. Loki himself could not tell a better story. God Shh. is light. But what have you done in his light? All are turned to their own way and gone astray into darkness. The devil has hold of your thoughts, your hearts, your very bodies. No one is safe. Whether you are pauper, king, or queen. Choose this day whom you will serve, for judgment is coming. And with it comes either deliverance or damnation. Let us pray. Gone. This little mother knows something about the Queen. I need to find her. Have you seen my husband? He should have been back from the room. You're troubled. It's my husband. He went for deliverance and hasn't come back. It's been days. Oh, it's all my fault. Tell me about deliverance. My husband was going to leave me, but he loves me. The devil got into him somehow. We sent him to Aquila for a deliverance ritual. Little mother said it would rid him of the devil. The rituals happen at Aquila. Yes. Little mother has a sanctum there. I think you should prepare for the worst. And pray to your god for the best. I should go to Aquila where rituals are being done. The saint defeats three Jotun by holding a cross before them. Lucky for him, Fenrir was not among them. Tavern Keep, I'm new here. Can you tell me about Little Mother? Oh, her deliverance rituals are all these drunkards talk about. Isn't that right, Bastion? You lad now shot. <laughs> <laughs> Take a seat, Narsoner. Bastion's buying, and he'll tell you all about it. Right, Bastion? That's me, all right. Bastion's a loud mouth. Bastien's a drunk, and let's not forget. Forgive my you intrusion. Have us at an advantage, but... Northerner. Where do you hail from? I just got in from Milan. Milan? You're not one of Siegfried's, are you? I'm just passing through, friend. Do not go through Aquila. That's where they take the poor fools for deliverance. They might take you too. <laughs> 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 
Tell me about Little Mother and her deliverance rituals. I can tell you it's a lot of extra work for us. Since she got her special prisoner, it's worse. Shh, Bastia! We can't speak of God's business. A special prisoner? Someone close to the king, they say. A woman, no less. Mon dieu, Bastien! Ah, but we cannot speak of that, lest God hears us. Drink up, my friends! Bastien is buying! Little mothers just won't let us rest. We are working day and night, and barely getting any sleep. I draw, the easier it will be to find the queen. The guard's key. It must unlock something nearby. what the Bellatores say. Surely little mother won't hurt her. It isn't right. The knife is well made. But the edge is dull. It would not cut easily. Oh! You startled me. You are one of the new assistants? Good. That is good. Yes, I have been sent to help. You've picked a bad time. They have the queen in there. It doesn't seem right. I... I don't think I can do it. I will. Tell me what to do. Really? Okay. Little Mother needs her knife dipped in sacrificial blood. It is on the table. Then, you must take it to her. All right. I'll prepare the knife and take it to Little Mother. You stay here.
This is not the work of God. You know the scriptures, Euphrasia. Where do they instruct you to do such things? My instruction comes from God, as you will soon see. That is the Queen. And she's being held by little mother. Those are our elite guards. Best not to try to take them head on. Maybe I can find a way to distract them. Oh, please, get me out of here! They will kill me! Those guards have the key to the cage. Opening it would create a distraction. We are discovered. Oh, thank God. I could not take any more. I was going to leave my wife. Now she... God, I could not take any more. I was going to leave my wife. Now she is... We have the queen of herself. Who would have thought we have the... What was that? God, set the cage. I should not be seen. 
Kane. Kane herself. Who would have thought we could reach her so soon? Where is my assistant? I cannot begin without my knife. When my assistant returns with my knife, your deliverance will begin. You should know, your majesty. I am only... Ah, here is my assistant with my knife. We can begin. I am little mother, touched by Saint Orinus, chosen by God. You are just another royal brood mare, mated to a king she doesn't love. In your bitterness, you turn him against God. You see, your majesty, you can hide nothing from a true servant of God. God himself knows I do not try. That is a lie. You speak for the devil now, do you know that? But we will cut him right out of you. Then we will get to the truth, you and God and I. Put your faith in that. Assistant, my knife! She was not always like this, and too young for such bitterness. Your methods are uncompromising, but your coming was God's doing. You are a northerner, aren't you? I am Eivor of the Raven Clan, and I am not here because of any god. I am here because your husband, the King, sent me. Charles sent you for me? There's no time. We have to find a way out before we are discovered. I know a way. Follow me. I did not thank you for rescuing me. It was a brave thing to do. It was not brave. I'm only here because I have an agreement with Charles to return you to rats. The plague is dead. Here. been used by God today. Do not doubt it. But I have to go now. There is somewhere I must be. It was not your God who freed you. It was me. And I did it only to return you to your husband. That is where we are going. You think because you did something it was not God? God used a donkey once. He can use anyone. Even you. Nevertheless, I'm taking you to Charles. It is not me Charles wants. I can trust you. I know it. I perceive God working something strange through you. I will show you what Charles seeks. You could be trying to deceive me. Yes, I suppose I could. But I am not. Do you really not see the strangeness in all this? That it must be God. I see only that your God makes it so you can never be wrong. <laughs> I like you, Eva. I can see why God chose you. And why we should be friends. We will go together. I 
mean to bargain with your husband, the king. But he is a complicated man. You're being diplomatic. Charles was not always as he is now. When he was a boy, he fell into fits of madness. His keepers believed him possessed. And put him for a ritual. His conversion afterwards was sincere. So he gained a terrible fear of fire. When we met, he was honorable and pious. You sound proud of Charles. You loved him. Do I? Yes, in a way. But we have never been a normal husband and wife, in private. Does he not love you? It is not him. I could never be what he needed. But he is a man, and found solace elsewhere. Often. The nun, little mother, was going to kill you. Perhaps. Her deliverance rituals were brutal and cruel. Few survived. Euphrasia belonged to a secret group that believes Francia has fallen into apostasy. She thought me possessed. The Bishop Engelwyn was part of this group, I think. You know of Engelwyn? Yes. They call themselves Bella Torres Dei. God's warriors. And there are more of them. You've brought me all this way to see a child. Yes. Charles has a son. Hey, get out there, this fools! Little bear. We saw this. You're safe. God protects me. Never doubt that, child. Bernard, this is Eivor, a friend. Go now and wash yourself. You've got more color on your shirt than on the canvas. He paints beautifully for a child, don't you think? He's better than many I've seen. Did you teach him? I do not have that gift. He got the ability from his mother, I think. Bernard is not your son. How could he be? Yet I love him as if he was. As I said, Charles and I were never that way. But he is a man, and a king. Naturally, he found other places to satisfy his appetites. From that came Bernard. You're hiding the boy from his father. Charles wants Bernard to succeed him to the throne. And Bernard wants nothing else but to please his father. That is why I must keep Bernard from him. He will lead the child down a dark path. One not meant for a good king. My agreement with Charles was only to return with you. The child need not be involved. And I will not let him be. Bernard knows to find a church if he needs help and I am not there. I must leave again for a while. When I return, I want to hear your Latin verbs. I know you're going to see father without me. I'm not stupid, you know. By keeping Bernard from Charles, you hope to prevent him becoming king. You misunderstand me, Eivor. Bernard must assume the throne for the good of Francia. You see what Charles has become. Bernard is young, but will make a good ruler. One that will be more sympathetic to your people, also. If Charles wants the child, he will not be pleased to see you without him. I hope that is not true. Charles knows the Bellatoris took me. He would be concerned. We have not been on good terms lately. But he sent you to free me. Perhaps he wishes to be reconciled. That bear is wounded. Wait. If it is wounded, it is dangerous. It is all right. Shh. Oh, what have you done to yourself? There. God is with you. Be more careful now. Off you go. There are noble animals. She had given up. She is all right now. Thanks to God. Are all bears so tame in Frankia? 
All of God's beasts respond to love, Eva. Even more so when they are hurt. In that, they are not so different to people. You have the gift with beasts. But you're speaking of Charles now. You think the same is true even of him? Especially of him. We are here. Charles Kemp. I fulfilled our agreement. Here's your wife, the Queen. She is unharmed. Charles. My dear wife. Finally, you appear before me. You must want for refreshment after your long and complicated journey. You are still angry. It is for nothing, Charles. I have been as faithful to you as I have been to God. I am sorry for taking Bernard, but... Ah, yes, my son. I thought by finding you, I would find him. But I do not see him. Where is Bernard? Safe. Do you remember the night we met? I've never forgotten it. The sky was clear and awash with thousands of stars. The night of our wedding, it was the same. I took it as a sign from God. I knew you and I were meant to be. You were in white, all purity and grace. I thought... Tonight, I am not the prince. I am the luckiest man alive. How lucky to take a wife who fell so easily into another's bed. You did not take me as your man, but as your fool. Charles, no. To our marriage. We had a deal. Do not be concerned about Bernard de Chardis. He is my son. Without your interference, he will find me. And you, northern devil, who presumes to sit at a negotiating table with a Frankish king. Here is your deal. You lied to me. I did not lie, Diable. I said God would make it so. And so he has. I will take care of God. Wait, you stay hidden. I damn you. I kill you. Almost finished. Let me take you. saying what they do not mean to get what they do not say they want I failed to mention everything about Charles I'm sorry the truth is awkward and I did not see the need he believes you to be unfaithful there is no end to his accusations I hoped he had come to himself do you think he really meant to kill us yes now Paris will fall Charles has made certain of that Secret was right. Don't despise Charles. Like that bear, he may yet recover with God's help and become your ally. I do not share your faith in your God or your husband, but you carry both with a rare honor. Thank you. That is a high compliment. For my part, I don't think God has finished with you yet. We were meant to meet. Now, I must find Bernard. 
We will go to the Paris slums and aid the sick. Charles will not look for us there. I must go meet Siegfried at the forward camp in Paris. I have a seat to prepare, and pride to swallow. God exalts the humble, Eivor of Raventlan. You will see. Farewell for now. Ah.